My name is Miles Batty. I graduated from Brigham Young University, participated in track and cross country, and graduated with degrees in neuroscience and exercise science. The best part about being on the track team at BYU was just being a part of a team. Even though it's not really a team sport, but just being able to represent BYU and all that I did, uh, the experiences I had with my teammates and my coach, and being able to accomplish the things I did wearing a BYU uniform. I'd say my top athletic achievement while at BYU happened my junior year at the uh, National Indoor Track Championships, where I was entered in two events, the distance medley relay as our anchor, as well as the individual mile. Uh, which would require me to actually run the mile three times within about a 24-hour period or so. And running those, I actually ended up running a four-minute mile three times and winning two national championships, anchoring our, our team to a, a relay national championship as well as winning the individual mile. And it was just a great feeling, something that I never really thought would be possible, but something that I was able to accomplish. Coach Ed Eyestone, he's the distance coach, so the cross-country coach, as well as works with the middle distance and distance runners on the track team. So he's the one that I worked with very consistently. From that, I learned that you know you don't always have to uh, be strict and stern to lead. That really, it's just more your attitude that you're able to be a leader. And you're leading by example, and you're leading just by the way you act around others and the way that you treat other people. I'd say the top academic achievement that I had was being named the Walter Byers Scholar. I didn't really know it existed, but was nominated by a professor, went through the application process, and I was very happy to know that I was awarded that scholarship, and it's just something that, to me, um, made me realize that I, ha I had done well. You know, I'd always kind of wondered or hoped that I was doing well enough and succeeding in all those areas, and that just kind of confirmed that to me. I think participating in sports taught me to drive, taught me to dream big, uh, but it also taught me to just be a good sport, to know that uh, you can try your best to accomplish something, but if you don't accomplish it, you can't hang your head or just become down about it. You just need to be able to go back to the drawing board, decide what to do better, and then try harder next time.